Hey, 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 if you're watching me, you're watching Julie. That's right, I'm Julie with the Julie Show. Where I need to hide my hands so I don't mess with my hair the whole video. I just did a video, and there was one small thing I mentioned. 17 in the video, and I deleted the whole thing. I'm feeling a lot better today. I'm noticing that my hair is starting to grow in a little bit more red than gray. And I know that my hair is really dark right now because I've been coloring it dark. But if it is going to continue to come in a reddish brown, I'm going to dye it closer to a reddish brown rather than a reddish bl or a blackish brown. My sister will tell me I didn't do it right. She'll say you didn't use the right developer, blah, 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 blah. Let me tell you what. The only times that I'd ever messed up my hair, I was very young, or I was in the care of a professional. Yes, I was in the care of a professional several times when they have three different ones, to be exact, that messed up my hair pretty bad. Not to mention all the in-between chop shops I've been to. Look, something goes wrong with my hair, and hair color doesn't turn out right. I re-dye it, it's fried a little bit, but look at how short it is. It's only a look, it's even way shorter in the back. So who cares? Now's the time to play with hair color, you know? You can't play with it when your hair's down to your freaking waist. Can't afford to go get it done, then you can't freaking do it yourself. I can't. I'm too disabled. Anyways, I got up today. I got ready. I put on some lashes because, I'll be honest with you, my face was just so pale. I put on bronzer and bronzer and more bronzer, and it is just... I even put on glow drops today. I'm, like, very pale. Probably because I haven't been feeling good. I've been showing you guys my foot. This is what I'm dealing with. So, and, yeah, I know, it doesn't really look all that bad up in this light because the light is the same color as the bruise. Um... The problem is, we're looking at a possible, maybe, gangrene starting. It could be neuropathy. It could be poor circulation. It could be so many things. It could be diabetes, even. I don't know. I have to go talk to my doctor Tuesday. I see my doctor in the city at 8.30. She's my specialist for lupus, so I'll have her look at my foot. Other than that, yeah, I got up. I got these new pants from Shein. I didn't know what kind of material they'd be. But I absolutely, look at how irregular they are. I absolutely love them. They go really good with this. It's a high waist. Everything's high waisted anymore. So what happens is, as you can see the length, these are very comfortable pants. They do resemble more of a, instead of a jogger, just more of a pajama pant. But the way they looked on the girl on the computer, I got them from Shein. She had them dressed up with a nicer shirt. So, if I were to wear, like, a nicer shirt, like a dress-up shirt, crop top, maybe a belt, some blue, a blue, some, like, black uh, boots, heel boots, yeah. So, anyways, yeah, I'm in a wig. I ordered a couple boxes of hair dye. Yeah, I'm in a box diet. Like I said, it's short. It doesn't matter. Um, then to get that done, um... Then, I'm not going to lie, I'm thinking about going back in and having her trim this up even more because I don't think she did what I wanted her to do. I don't want this hair growing out underneath. I want this to be level at all times growing out so this catches up with that and then grows out at one length. She touched up my layers. Oh, well. It's cute. I don't care. It's cute no matter who does it. It doesn't matter. It's the same damn haircut. Anyways, with that being said, I want y'all to have a good weekend. Say a quick prayer for me and my husband. He has to deal with me. And, you know, nobody's perfect. He's got his own stuff going on, too, so... I gotta get off of here because all I do when I'm on video is look at my hair. This is why I don't even look in the mirror. Once I get done getting ready for the day, I'm done with mirrors. I, I fidget way too much. And I don't think I fidget at all when I can't see it. And I really honestly don't know if I like the bra straps hanging out there. 
What do you think? Oh, yeah, for sure. I gotta go. I'm not going braless. It does not happen. But it will go strapless. Oh, yeah. That's much better. All right, guys. I will let you go. Enjoy this Friday. Enjoy the weather wherever you're at. May you go in peace. This is not peace. This means please. I don't know why I got peace and please confused. But thank you for understanding that I repeat. I repeat. I went to school. I had the knowledge. The knowledge. I know how to sign. This means sign. I don't remember what that means. I learned a couple more yesterday, but I have to. I got to practice them. And they also know uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, and diez. I finally know how to count to ten. It was always everything after uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. <laughs> I'll let Dora explore payoff. <laughs> I actually went to take you guys upstairs and show you the cream that I have been using for my under eyes because they look really amazing. Considering I got a little bit going on over here, it's nothing compared to what they can look like. And it's called Bye Bye Under Eye. I don't know the name brand and I'm not going to go up there and look because the last time I did it in the video that I just deleted, unfortunately I went all the way up there and I forgot why I was there. <laughs> I'm not doing that again. There is some Jim Beam in my fridge. There is some Jack Daniels. No, there's Jim Beam and there's Captain Morgan. And there's a couple bottles of wild turkey. Little bottles. I may end up doing a little day drinking today just because I don't feel all that well. My foot needs to... The only thing is, is if I do a little day drinking and my foot gets worse. And I do have to go to the urgent care and be like, have you been drinking? Yeah. Oh, well. I don't know what to do. I am ordering more than wood carts. I'm making more of them. I mean, that's like a little miniature jewelry box that I just built for 10 bucks. That I could deck out in any color. I can go buy new knobs for it instead of the wood balls. I made these little suckers too. The only problem is the tops. Are just a little bit too wide. I haven't glued them on down yet. I want to glue them in there. I may have to find a way to trim that up. But then there's this one, and then this one. I thought these were so cute. They're just like 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 little like make believe oceans. Now technically, I could take the whole rock off. Oh, I guess I can. And put this inside there, I guess. Ultimately, it's ultimately I think some of it's supposed to go inside. But yeah, I made them. Those are cute little things. And I had the glass and the yarn. And I bought these for another project that didn't turn out. So I just went ahead and threw them in there. I thought they looked good. I had another idea for these glass jars, but that's okay. I mixed some sugar and some salt together. Looks like sand to me. All right, guys. I want you to go in peace. I want you to have a great weekend. If something goes wrong with my foot, or if it gets even better miraculously, or if I win the lottery, I'll let you know. No, I'm kidding. I will never let you know if I win the lottery. My lawyer will be letting you know. All right, with that all being said, bye-bye.